Ansem Merchant Bank Limited and its financial services group of companies have recorded a 76% increase in profit before tax for the year ending December 31, 2021. Last year, Ansem Merchant Bank's profit before tax was $360 million. In 2020, its profit before tax was $205 million. Ansem Merchant Bank Chairman A. Norman Sabga says this robust increase was driven largely by mark-to-market -market investment valuations arising from the recovery in the local and international equity markets. Sabga says, I am encouraged by these strategic initiatives and by our record results which speak to an efficiently run financial services group that is made up of a diversified portfolio of banking and insurance companies. Sabga says, given the improved business performance compared to 2020, the directors have recommended a final dividend of $1 per share for the year ending December 31st, 2021. The Trinidad and Tobago Manufacturers Association will be leading a physical trade mission to Guyana from March 28th to March 31st. TTMA President Trisha Kusal, who will lead the mission, says, TTMA has continued to pursue Guyana as an export market of interest on behalf of our members hosting a virtual trade mission in 2021 due to COVID-19. This physical trade mission will comprise 21 local manufacturers comprising food and beverage, printing and packaging, chemicals and construction sectors. The TTMA says it will be strengthening its relationship with Guyana via hosting trade missions to Guyana annually and having the participation of Guyanese companies at TIC 2022. Trade and Industry Minister Paula Gopiskun says the recent introduction of the business process outsourcing industry in this country has the potential of creating 1,300 new jobs by the end of this year. Gopi Schoon says in the last 15 years, the BPO sector created 43,600 jobs regionally and attracted over a billion US dollars. Trinidad and Tobago, however, has a more recent and growing BPO industry, which consists of a healthy mix of global service providers and domestic players serving markets locally across the Caribbean and throughout North and Latin America. Gopi Schoon made the comments while speaking during the opening of ICOR's newest centre in Shagornas. This is ICOR's third centre nationwide. Joel Julian, CNC3 Business Watch.